washing tube is the modern version of what is said to have originated in Chile, where they took cactus branches and cactus thorns and made a rain stick. This tube is made out of the cardboard center of gift wrapping paper. The cardboard is nice and thick. I measured along the diagonal um, every half inch and pushed in a flathead nail so that it makes half a helix, or a single helix rather, and then taped um, the bottom closed with a cut out from a piece of index card. I, I traced the circle of the bottom and then cut a little bit larger than the diameter and made pieces that could be folded in to then tape on the bottom. In a real life situation, you would want to do that on the top also, but I have cut open the top of this to show you some of the various that you can do making this. Um, the sound that you hear is pieces of basmati rice. I put in probably about a cup in this. And the rice is hitting against each of the little nails, making a clicking sound. Altogether, there's so many pieces of rice that it comes out sounding like white noise, which is the sound that you might hear from, well, a white noise machine or um, on an AM station when it's not tuned in quite exactly. I'm going to show you something else we can do. Here's the basmati rice. One of the variations is what's the size of the pieces that are going down the tube. We're going to exchange the basmati rice for dried pinto beans and see if you can hear the difference in the sound. So here's the new rain stick, which would have two ends capped so they could use it. Another variable is a shorter tube, and this is from a paper towel. Um, some people like the longer ones so that if this is the kind you have, you can take two paper towel rolls and put them together. Um, because the cardboard is a little thinner on um, this, um, there's more likelihood that the nails could pop out, so I have put the nails in the same pattern with the same measurements but taped around them. This one has pinto beans also. Hope you enjoy it. This can be messy.